Good morning, sir. I was told that you want to talk to me. Good morning to Ms. Tara. Yes. I have received here a budget proposal for the implementation of our OSH programs. I might have forgot about all this. Are you one of those who draft this proposal? Ah. Yes, sir. Together with our OSH committee. Good. I just have some questions and points for clarification before I'll proceed with approving it. Okay, sir. Under the proposed health programs, you have included the cost here for health examinations. May I know, what are the different health examinations that you are proposing? Are these really necessary? Yes, sir. These are mandatory pursuant to Rule 1966.02 of the OSH standard. The health examinations should be the following. 1. Entrance. 2. Periodic examination. 3. Special examination if applicable. 4. Transfer examination and 5. Separation examination. I see. Can you explain further on the requirement for physical examination? Based on Rule 1967 of the OSH standard, for physical examination, all workers, irrespective of age and sex, shall undergo physical examination before entering employment for the first time, periodically, or at such intervals as may be necessary on account of the conditions or risks involved in the work, when transferred or separated from employment, and when injured or ill. Ow. And these will be shouldered by the employer? I think yes, sir. In paragraph 2 of the said rule, it states that all examinations shall be complete and thorough, be rendered free of charge to the workers, and shall include X-ray or special laboratory examinations when necessary due to the peculiar nature of the employment. I see. Okay, Ms. Tara, thank you so much for the clarifications. By the way, we have just hired a new occupational health nurse. Could you please discuss and inform her on this requirement and other important OSH standard, particularly Rule 1960? Ah, yes, sir. There is indeed a discussion on the applicable OSH standard during orientation of our new hires. In the case of occupational health nurse and other occupational health personnel, Rule 1960 is also one of the topic that is discussed only with them. Great, thank you so much Ms. Tara. That's it for now. Thank you for your time. You may go back to your work now. I will just call you in case I will need further inputs. Thank you so much too sir. I must leave now. Have a nice day, sir.